I'm Professor Richard Catlow. I'm a professor of chemistry at University College London and Cardiff Universities. I am also, until the end of next year, the Foreign Secretary of the Royal Society, which means I take the lead on the international work of the Society. I've spent my career working in chemistry as a researcher, a teacher and a university leader. I'm absolutely committed to the key role of the discipline in contemporary society. And more generally, chemical sciences will be crucial in responding to the major global challenges of this century, including the one we're passing through at present. But challenges such as climate change, energy, food security, and global health. And indeed, many of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals, SDGs, will require substantial input from chemistry if they're to be achieved. Now, the Royal Society of Chemistry is amongst the world's leading chemical societies, and it will make a vital contribution in promoting the health of the discipline in the UK and worldwide. So I would very much like to use my experience as a research scientist, as a teacher, and a university leader to work with RSC members and staff to foster and promote the discipline. Uh, there are many challenges. First, the president of the Royal Society of Chemistry is a leading figure in the scientific community who will need to work with other learned societies, academies, universities, education leaders, and of course, industry uh, to promote the cause of science generally. I also think there are still challenges in the perception of the discipline, although RSC has done great work here. But we do need to continue to get across to the public and policymakers the vital importance and excitement of chemistry. Linking to this issue, there are, of course, challenges in funding and in investment and in chemical education. Now, I mentioned industry it's very important that society continues to help to maintain the health and strength of the UK chemicals industry. Diversity is, of course, a key issue in which the society is doing very good work, but would need to continue to press on this matter. Well, I think there is a very exciting future for the discipline. Chemistry is at the heart of science and society. And that is, in fact, the title of a lecture which I very much enjoy giving. And its importance is increasingly recognised, although, as I said earlier, we do need to continue to work to emphasise its importance. But we're attracting talented young people into the discipline, which I know from my work in universities with students and early career staff. And we will need to foster and develop their careers. I'm sure that the Royal Society of Chemistry will continue to play a crucial role in maintaining and developing the health of the discipline. And I very much hope that I can contribute to this work. So thank you again.